In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use a T-square and a triangle to draw four squares on a piece of paper. The piece of paper we're using is 8 and a half by 11. It's a typical sheet of copier paper. So, um, first of all, I'll go over the tools that you'll need. A T-square. This is a T-square. It's a perfectly 90 degree right angle. We'll need a ruler. We'll need a triangle, a mechanical pencil, or a very sharp pencil, non sticky tape, a white eraser. White erasers are good, they don't tear up your paper as much as pink erasers do. And um, I believe I mentioned a sheet of white paper. So First of all, the T-square. It's really important that you understand how to use a T-square. The T-square has this ledge on it, and that's what makes it work so well. It, it, you hook it on the side of a table or a desk, and you're able to slide up and down with it. What I don't want to see is people using a T-square like this or like this. That just defeats the whole purpose of a T-square. So it needs to be right on the edge, and you need to firmly place it there. So I'm going to firmly place it here, and I'm going to tape down this piece of paper so that it is at a perfectly 90 degree angle to the T-square. So here's one piece. And you don't need much tape. You just don't want it to get too sticky or anything. So we're going to start by determining the center of this page. We know it's eight and a half inches wide, so the half of that would be four and a quarter. So I'm going to make a mark at four and a quarter inches. We know that it's 11 inches tall, so I'm going to make a mark at five and a half inches. And we'll take the triangle and mark that out. So just hold the triangle very firmly next to the T-square and move it out of the way because we're going to slide it up, slide the T-square up. And we're going to draw a horizontal line at the five and a half mark. So now that we have the center, we can determine uh, where to put the squares. So we want the squares to be a half an inch apart. So I'm going to make a mark uh, on a quarter inch on one side of the halfway point and a quarter inch on the other side. And then while I'm at it, I'm going to measure out three inches because these are three inch squares. Three inches here. And then we'll do the same thing on the vertical axis. We're going to mark it a quarter of an inch from the center on each side. And then mark three inches up and three inches down. And now at this point, we don't need to measure anymore. We can do the rest of it with just the T-square and the triangle. So I'm sliding the T-square up to the first horizontal mark. And we don't need to worry about going over because we'll just erase anything that's over uh, the line anyway. So we can make the vertical lines here. And then we go, go back and make all of the horizontal lines. So 
So now we can just go back and erase anywhere we went over with the pencil lines. We can come back later and ink in these uh, our boxes with a pen. And then there you can see you have your four boxes there.